GVN gang, welcome back to another vlog. So today is the day we are leaving America. Pretty sad day. Really enjoying this place, honestly. I see why people move out here. This is a really nice place to live. I thought it would be the exact opposite in my opinion. I did not think that I would actually say that living here would have been would be cool, but I don't know. I, I, I definitely think it is. But today we are getting packed. I wouldn't. I won't show you behind me because it is a pigsty. Um, but we are getting packed up. We're going to do a few things. Not too sure what we're going to do yet. We're going to go back uh, and exchange some of my jeans. Um, your boy is a bit too. He doesn't like the non-skinny jeans, so we're going to go back there. Bit of an emo kid, so I need the, I need the tight, the tight legs. You know what I'm saying? But so we're going to go for a bit more of a shop. See what I can find. If there's anything else I'll, I can find there, I'll probably buy that as well. We need to buy another bag for the stuff we bought because it won't fit in the current luggage that we have. So, bought a lot, but I think buying it here in comparison to Australia is just like tenfold different. You, you get a lot more for what you pay. Same with food as well. You get a lot more for what you pay. So, we're going to pack now and then we'll be on our way to the shops. Probably the shops first. I, I don't know what else we can do. I, I kind of want to go to Supreme store, but we'll plan out our day after we've packed and then we'll go from there. I've been sleeping on this couch the entire trip. We haven't even, haven't even looked at the bed, to be honest. This was the comfiest thing we've ever had. And TV's right here. Why would we not do that, honestly? Being in the bedroom, it's cool, but it doesn't have any entertainment, you know what I'm saying? I need the entertainment to sleep. After fruit and vegetables, especially. Sad times. We're almost done packing up. Just got a few more things to go. And then all of this shit we have to buy a new bag for. We bought too much stuff, but it's good because we get to try out a lot of stuff that we don't want. So we're going to the shops again to get more shit anyway. So I'm excited for that. Well, this is it. We are all packed. Everything's gone. I feel like this place has not been inhabited whatsoever. I'm gonna miss it here, but it's time to go back home, time to face reality. I mean, let's, let's just book another holiday, I guess. And yeah, see you later, Los Angeles. So, just heading out of our apartment now. Really good experience, had no problems, no complaints here, besides obviously the mobility scooters. Makes no sense to me why people can actually use those pieces of, pieces of flavin, but we're on our way now. I don't know what we're doing today, we're gonna go shopping. So, we're gonna head there first, I think, but we're gonna probably see a few sites on the way as well. I really wanna see this goddamn squirrel. I bet you now I'm recording. I've come down here four times. But you now I'm recording, I won't see the squirrel. It almost jumped on me before. Come on, you piece of shit squirrel. Mother squirrel, where are you? See what I mean? Always my luck. Nothing. Nothing. Gonna miss the squirrels. I hate it. I hate that we don't have squirrels in Australia. So after two miserable attempts at trying to get to the Hollywood sign, we're now on our way to the outlets. The roads are just crazy here. I, up there especially, I, I just can't move. I have no idea how they even fathom and tell people that that's a two-laned road because that was, that was barely enough for one car, let alone two cars, so. I just shat myself a little bit, but we're on our way to the outlets. Gonna see, I shouldn't have just done that, but we're gonna see what we can purchase. Hopefully there's some other decent things there. Whoa, that's a big drop. Oh my God, I'm trying to focus on the vlog, but I'll keep driving over mounds and what the flavin is that in the road? But um, yeah, we're on our way. We'll get there. I probably won't record any of the actual shopping because I don't know, people don't really want to see shopping, but. It's gonna be good to go back there and just check out what's there. So I just arrived at the outlets. We're gonna do a bit of shopping here as well. Just pick up some last minute things and then we'll be on our way. I have a feeling to the car rental place. I don't know if we'll be able to do anything else. We'll try and get something else done, but it's gonna be pretty hard. It's gonna be pretty hard. I don't know how long we're gonna be here for. So we're gonna shop and then, yeah, I, I, I don't know what's gonna happen from there, but it's sad. I'm just gonna keep saying it's really sad that this is the end. I, I don't even believe it is real that I'm going to be flying back to Sydney and driving on the opposite side of the road it's weird to even say that but this place is amazing <laughs> just keep me here 
Alright, so basically I didn't record a lot of the outlet just simply because I thought three hours would be enough, you know, I thought easy. Finish it all, get it done. Wouldn't sweat it. Uh, but it ended up with us having to leave at like 3.40, planned to leave at 3 o'clock, to be honest, originally. I ran to coach, picked up shoes. I ran to Calvin, picked up undies. I had to run everywhere, literally, just to, just to buy the things that I wanted to, because you're only here for a limited time. You, must, you, you may as well buy everything that you need, and so I can throw all this shit out, but it was stressful. I, I would have recorded, but I did not want to see myself sweating, so um, I basically just got in the car, turned on the air conditioner, and here we are, I guess. Um, that was all done very smoothly, no stress involved whatsoever. Obviously, a bit of sarcasm involved, but we're heading to the rental place now, the rental company. We had to buy two suitcases, so originally, we thought one would be enough, one big suitcase. Uh, I mean, $110 later, it's fine. Yeah, nah. <laughs> No, we bought way too much. We bought way too much, so we had to literally buy a secondary suitcase just to fit all the stuff that we bought. It almost filled up from the stuff we had bought today. And we had other stuff we had to put on top of it, but... Oh my God, I'm yeah, I'm, I'm stressing out a bit and this traffic isn't helping me. Anxiety's kicking in. I'm struggling. I'm mad that I have to leave. So many emotions, but... I have to come to an end. I've said it like... I like this vlog as well, I keep repeating myself, but ah, I'm going to miss America so much, I really am, really good place, really nice people, everyone is amazing, shopping is great, food is great, I wish we had Chipotle, let's be real here, I'm going to miss Chipotle a lot, but yeah, so we're on our way to the car rental company now, and then from there we're going straight to the, sorry, <laughs> straight to the, straight to the airport, god damn it, no! <laughs> Why are we here? Why are we here? Take me home. Not home here, as in like not not in Australia, just here. This is when you don't plan ahead at all. We are struggling right now. Like this car has been stripped to shreds. These bags have been stripped to shreds. I bought literally both of these suitcases like an hour and a half ago, and they're already packed to the brim. Had these. Had this. We have this bag. Like that bag I've got a... it's crazy it's crazy I don't know what I'm gonna do I don't know what we're gonna do but I'm stressing out real bad real real bad we'll figure it out too many bags too many I am dead who's checking in now but what a mission trying to get four bags two Two backpacks on this one is white. Oh, God. I hate airports, just low key. It's like the most depressing place or the most exciting place. It's never in between. When the hell did this happen? USB chargers at seats. Revolutionary. So we've got to stop at San Fran first before we go to Sydney, but I'm exhausted and the jet lag is going to kill me. I think it's like, it's 14 hours, yeah? Yeah, I think so. 14 hour flight. And a depressing one. I wanna die, I wanna die. So we're on our way, so we're in San Fran at the moment, we're on our way to the Sydney gate for our 40,000 hour flight back to Sydney, but I just realised that we're going to be on a plane for 12 hours and then we literally have IEM Sydney in that morning as well. I think it's like 7am or something, so it's going to be a long day. I'm not going to get any sleep on a plane, I guarantee it. I'm going to try, but I'm never going to get sleep on a plane. I can't do it. I just can't. No matter how hard I try, it just never happens. I just went on the dodgiest one of these planes just then. This is the final boarding call for Air New Zealand Flight Weird, it sounded like they were about to break off. I thought I was in, I don't know, snakes on a plane or something. I thought I was about to get attacked. It was pretty intense. Get me on this plane. I just want to go to sleep.
nice day. So we just arrived in Sydney again. I think it's like 7 a.m. in the morning. I've had like two hours sleep. So I'm, I'm gonna struggle to I'm gonna struggle to get to IEM, but we're here now. I'm gonna close off the previous vlog obviously because I'm have like IM Sydney vlog as well, so I don't want them to clash so Thank you for watching and it's a sad day, but I will see you next vlog. GVN, play that back, boy.